Here's Gary Bender. Okay, Pat, Nancy Ritchie now serving Love 15, leading in the second set to Love after winning the first set 6-1. Her opponent, Leslie Hunt. Here's Nancy Ritchie out of San Angelo, Texas. Cliff Drysdale and Virginia Wade alongside us here with the expert commentary. Love 30. Nancy has been playing a very routine match. She hasn't been playing quite as much this year, but she's always been one of the best players on the surface. And she's just pounding away very successfully. Very uncharacteristic point for this match with Nancy Ritchie being aggressive and at the net there. Virginia, Leslie Hunt really has a major problem what has she got to do to beat this girl her game is naturally an aggressive one and yet she's playing on clay against a clay expert i always think that nancy ritchie is one of the toughest players of all to play against because you just have to be prepared to stay out there for a long long time you can move her around she isn't the quickest player but she tends to put so much pressure on you that you don't have the chance to move her around but somehow you have to make the openings also as she hasn't been playing quite that much one's got to wonder whether whether or not she would survive a long match so if you can push her then the, the odds have to be with you doing a little better so leslie hunt does pick up a game though in the second set she trails one two as nancy ritchie winning the first set six one this action now at the grandstand area just outside the stadium area where chrissy everett will be coming up next as tony and pat We'll be bringing the action on that. Nancy Ritchie comes from quite a family, but let's switch a moment to some football. As you know, the NFL season's going to be getting underway right here on CBS, and look at the regional games coming up. The Rams and the Falcons, Detroit and Chicago, and then that will be followed up by the doubleheader. I know everyone looking forward to that. Dallas against Minnesota. That could be a preview of the playoffs coming up. So we start our coverage of the regular season, continuing on grandstand here's Gary Bender all right the situation is we're in a tiebreaker in the second set Leslie Hunt leading one nothing over Nancy Ritchie Ritchie winning the first set 6-1 and it looks like that ball was good 2 nothing this is of course the 12 point tiebreaker there's Nancy Ritchie Second serve. Out. And that ball was out, one, two, to Leslie Hunt. Incidentally, she served for the second set in order to get herself into this tiebreaker. Something that I'm sure she's not feeling too happy about right now. Said for the second set and could have closed it out at one set all. Now has to go through the tiebreaker with Nancy Ritchie. First serve. Ritchie trailing one two. out to all so it's now to all both these girls playing very careful tennis as you mentioned earlier Nancy just doesn't make those errors three two hunt, hunt. Leslie Hunt still not taking advantage of her aggressive game and coming into the net, but it seems to have worked a lot better for her in the second set. Leslie Hunt serving at 3-2. And that time she did play in a really aggressive shot to, to go ahead 4-2. 
And of course at 4-2 in the tiebreaker, there's a change of sides. Players are not supposed to towel off, just walk directly over to the opposite side and continue playing. It's one continuous game, this tiebreaker. Leslie Hunt, however, taking the opportunity to get a quick drink. Back at the stadium action, Chris Everett has held her service, and in the second set, after winning the first set, 6-2, she leads one love. Leslie Hunt serving 4-2, she leads in this tiebreaker second set. She lost the first set. Must have been on the line. Very short lob. Leslie, I'm not too happy with that shot. I can understand why it was a very short lob. She was really not under any pressure when she played it. 4 3. Leslie Hunt leading. I hesitate really to talk about any advantage that any, either one of these two girls has got on their own serves because their serves are really nothing much to talk about, particularly on a clay court like this, and all they're using it for really is to get the ball in play. She now is pulled even at four apiece. Long rallies in this entire match between these two girls. Both of these two girls gritting their teeth. Challenging the other one to miss first. Four four in this 12 point tiebreaker. Leslie Hunt tried something a lot more aggressive there. Her forehand down the line was a fine shot. She then went in for the drop shot, hoping to break the game of Nancy Ritchie up somewhat. It did not work out, however. Nancy was right on that ball and played a great passing shot, uh, cross-court short, sharp cross-court shot. Richie leading 5-4 in this tiebreaker. Second set. She won the first. And Leslie Hunt taking advantage of a fine approach shot. Five all. It's going to be a win by two situation here. Nancy Ritchie leading 5-6. Six. Six, it is match point for Nancy Ritchie. Right, it is 6-5. The font was not right. As you mentioned, Cliff, it is match point. These girls determined not to miss. And it's long, and Nancy Ritchie wins the tiebreaker, the set, and the match. So Nancy Ritchie wins 7-6 in the second set, winning the first set 6-1. And now let's go back to the stadium and center court.